So you think that homeschool is boring? Because I never get to play. Yeah, because like, we just moved, and so we don't have really anything set up. What about all the adventures we went on? Yeah, yeah. That was then. But no! So now you want it to be more fun again? Yes. Okay. Don't worry. Mommy's going to make it more fun again. Yes! Just to let you I guys know, school house. is not fun for people every single day. Because I the stations that we used to do. Oh. That was a long time ago. Yeah, we'll, do, we'll put back all that stuff, okay? Okay. Let's go to school right now. Lately, my girls have been saying that homeschool is boring. And if I'm honest, it has been. My kids are used to going places and doing things every day. The world is their classroom, but after the week-long mega road trip we took last month to move across the country from California to Maryland, homeschooling has been really boring to them, meaning a lot of book work. Not a lot of hands-on learning, projects, and field trips like they're used to. It's taking a lot of energy for me to set up my new home, so I decided to enroll them in school. But this isn't any school. It's a special school just for... Hold on, wait. First, let me tell you about the sponsor of today's video, Night Zookeeper. I know I'm not alone in having children who aren't totally enthusiastic this time of year about homeschooling, but there are things we can do to keep our kids happy and engaged, like choosing a super fun and engaging curriculum. So, in addition to what you're about to see in this video, I've added a fantastically fun language arts curriculum to our homeschool program, Night Zookeeper, who is the sponsor of today's video. So, if you're still struggling with language language arts or just engaging your kid in general, it's not too late to introduce a new language arts program to your homeschool plan. It's still early enough in the school year to make changes and see positive results in your child's language arts skills by the end of the school year. Made for children ages 6 through 12, Night Zookeeper takes the stress out of teaching language arts by making it genuinely fun and engaging for your child. And since it's fun, there's no back and forth or arguing during your teaching. So instead of having tension during your lesson, you and your child have an enjoyable learning experience. The children learn through skill games, interactive lessons, and tutor feedback. So you can be as hands-on or as hands-off as you'd like, which means you have time to focus on other tasks, prepare for other subjects, or teach other children. You can adjust the level based on your child's needs, and the skills that will improve are reading, writing, spelling, grammar, and vocabulary. Plus, there's a parent dashboard so you can monitor your child's progress and have reports to give during your homeschool reviews. With my link, you all will receive a seven-day trial and 50% off an annual subscription, so try Night Zookeeper for today. Thank you to Night Zookeeper for sponsoring this video. Now back to the video. I'm doing my homework camera. I have to camouflage this humongous cat. That's your that's homework? Awesome. To yes. color that in? No, to camouflage it. Mookie, okay, is there other any other homework you're supposed to be doing? Um, no. Well, last okay. Tuesday she told us to do this. Okay. Wow. Days go by fast. The days do go by fast. How are you enjoying school? I'm enjoying school very well. Especially this one. The homework is optional, but I want to instill in my girls that you can always do more than what's required. So I suggested making a digital representation of a big cat camouflaging instead. Even if you don't homeschool, there are so many ways you can give your children a world-class education in just a few minutes a day. It took time, but they practiced removing backgrounds, editing the contrast and warmth of photos, and adding text. Almost creating a deep fake. <laughs> you know I'm all about making sure our children are armed with an education for the future. These digital skills will definitely put them at an advantage as they get older. Ooh, very good work. Okay, let's put it in with your stuff for school. You can show your teacher, okay? We picked up somebody else's work. Okay, girls, we need to get all this stuff together right now because you're going to be late if we don't come on right now. Do so you guys remember the names of the other kids? Yes, Claire and Charlie. James. Well, what about the other kids? How many kids are in the class? Wait, how many kids are in this class? Uh, which is it art? Today is um, veterinary science. Um, supposed to be four. Oh, okay. It's a very small yeah. class size. Let's Six. go. Six? Yes. Yeah. yeah, it's a really small class size. Let's go. You shouldn't feel like, oh, it's not real school because the class size is so small. A lot of private schools have very small class sizes. Just need to, do we bring our whole book bag in? Yeah, come on. Bring everything. Let's go. Where's your, is your apron? 
Yeah. Alright, come on, let's go. It's, it's in my bag. That's like your uniform. You need to make sure you guys have that. Girls, you're about to be late. You guys are just. I'm waiting for a week. Did you guys bring your homework? Yes. yes. Did you guys bring a lunch? Yes. Okay. Wait! Oh, sorry. Oh, no, you're not trying to bring an iPad. <laughs> you think you can bring toys to school? I want to show her. Come on. Uh, just close all Just to let you know, in, in public school, you can't bring any toys. You'll get it confiscated. What is com- Oh. Go take it away. Yeah. That you can take it, that Queen public Azzurri. school. Queen Azalea would love to see the snake. Oh, it looks like the other class isn't out yet. Yep, everybody's here. Hi. 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 Hey. Hi. Hello. Hi. Good morning. Oh, I love your outfit. Good morning. <laughs> <laughs> little Jesse costume. Yes. <laughs> I want to do the Zoom because it will be free for homeschoolers. Uh, like we're doing the aquarium <laughs> in January. <laughs> So I see the zebra. Yes, well, I want the lion. You hit a oh wow, okay. <laughs> Does this this sit over here? Yes. Oh cool. Looking. Okay. Here it comes one. one. <laughs> <laughs> then it comes running slow. No. <laughs> that is wonderful. As I said earlier, this is a school for homeschoolers. Now you might ask, why homeschool if you're gonna send your kids to classes? Well, as you'll see with this model, you can have small group classes, choose and have a partnership with your child's teacher, keep parent and community oversight, and have a relaxed child-centered learning environment where children can have fun and mistakes are celebrated. This micro school is run by Mrs. Danny, a former homeschooler who went to college early and has a degree in psychology. It's located in a school building that's been repurposed as a community arts building. Currently, the girls are taking veterinary science and art. You can take as many or as few classes as you'd like. Class sizes are small and the children get plenty of time to create, speak, and discuss. Parents are free to stay and although in the little kids class it seems like they do, we as a big kid parents have earned the right to sit in our cars or go for coffee. I chose to put them in, what is it, Dreamers? Mm -hmm. Dreamers Kingdom. Um, specifically this class because it's the entrepreneur and art mm -hmm. combined. I also wanted them to get like a social aspect. Um, my daughter loves animals and veterinarian science. It was like, and then I'm like an artsy person myself. So it's like checking all the boxes and then the social aspect. Thank you guys. I just randomly just asked them to be on film, so thank you guys. <laughs> okay, while the girls are in class, I have a couple hours to get some work done. I'm trying to take stuff out of here. Okay, 97.4, you're good. Okay, guys. No one has a fever. I learned how to milk a cow, and I took a horse, I, I took a foal out of a horse's. <laughs> and my favorite part was was milking the cow because it got everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> Many vaccines. And then I learned how to take a tumor. I, had, I learned how to cut a tumor off of a lung for the dog mm -hmm. if they have cancer. Um, my favorite part was giving the vaccine to the cow and milking the cow because we, we got to like spray it everywhere. Well, no, we didn't ha We didn't get to, but the, when we were milking the cows, they went everywhere and it looked like we were actually milking cows. You were my helper. Oh, I learned sorry. how to milk a cow and my favorite part was Sewing up for animals. Thank you, Zoe. Go ahead and get your prize. Okay, guys, thank you so much but for coming. I didn't go. You didn't go? 
I thought you would. No, go ahead. I'm so sorry. Go ahead. Um, how to take a tumor out of Max and to cut it off of the lungs. And because he had uh, cancer. cancer. Yeah, cancer. And there was something like this on his lungs. And my favorite part was probably pulling the lung out and cutting it. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Homeschool is like it's like um, a very different change to regular school because mm -hmm. I, I will have like I have friends right now but like I have a, like a bunch of friends in real school so right. I miss them and like some of them they don't even have phones or anything like that so I won't be able to talk to them but I will still remember them I hope they still remember me but like oh I hope my friends still remember me too yeah wait is this my okay. well you guys can be each other's friends now okay how are you liking homeschool. <laughs> Honest opinion. Um, I like it. You like it? What What do you like about it? Uh, I like that we do, I learn a lot more. Yeah, yeah. I went home from yeah. sixth grade to twelfth and then graduated early. Well, I don't think you can homeschool for college. Yeah, because I'm going to Harvard. Yeah. I'm going to Harvard. If we don't I'm oh, you're going to Harvard? Go girl. Go girl. You, go, you want to go to St. Tim? And just a reminder, go check out Night Zookeeper. You have a seven-day free trial when you use my link and 50% off of your annual subscription. Thanks again to Night Zookeeper for sponsoring this video.